Hello everyone and welcome back. I've had a little bit of time off. I've been getting married so I'm back here to make a few more videos. I hope you'll excuse the absence. And this one today is just going to be a bit of a quick tip. It's going to be something that I find really useful myself and I didn't know about for years but it's going to save you loads of time and maybe demystify a few of those things around selection in Toon Boom, especially when you're using the node view and you are rigging. So let's take a look. So what am I talking about when I say selection and uh, especially deep selection? Well, here we have a rig that's been being worked on for the Academy and this character is called Lenny. And what we have on the outside of the group in the node view, this is a very common thing you see with rigs is you see a group and a master peg. And then you can tell it's a group because there's an arrow on the right hand side that takes us inside and we can see all the things going on there. Now, to select something when you are animating, you tend to click on part of it and press B, or maybe you click on a, um, a shortcut, uh, kind of a handle to select, a quick selector. But you can, the traditional way, just click on something, press B. It's moving up that chain, that hierarchy there, you see? So if I click on this head peg first and then press B, it goes up to this peg. And that's the traditional way to move up and down. But if you want to select things in the node view, it's a little bit different because if I wanted to select all of the head, um, you can see how it's only selecting that peg there. So I would have to literally drag over everything in here. And there's a chance that I'm going to miss something. OK, so that's kind of a, a bit of a pain. Maybe you want to select everything inside a group and um, you have to go and select it and then you have to hold down, you know, um, to add to the selection, you have to hold down the shortcut. Now, this shortcut I'm going to teach you now for deep selection is going to be a massive time saver when you want to select everything inside the group and deeper down. Why would you want to do that? Well, sometimes when you are selecting to create a master controller, that's what all these little sliders and things are doing here, or um, you just want to select everything here, because if I just drag over that group and then go inside, it's not actually selected anything. So how do I select or deep select all the way through? Well, if you hold down the Alt key or the Option key on a Mac, then drag over, then click to go inside, you will see it's selected everything all the way through. The deepest of deep selections, as I'd like to refer to it. So it's a really simple shortcut that a lot of people miss, and it's going to save you a lot of time in selecting things. Let's not forget, it's not the same as selecting something here and pressing B and going up through that thing. That's just selecting this peg, nothing below it. This is selecting all the elements. That includes the, the cutters and all the other sort of things going on with the nodes that you have. So it's a different kind of selection, which is very useful for rigging, but it's not to be animated with. It's slightly different to that. I hope that deep selection shortcut tip was useful to you. I know it was to me when I found out about it. And uh, good luck and happy animating or rigging. I'll see you in the next video.